Hi guys, I'm Woodcraft Hamster and I thought I'd do a quick video today about making a replacement handle from, uh, for a fro. Um, you've seen me use this a few times on uh, other videos. Um, this is the Ray Isles Premium Fro. Um, very, very good bit of kit. Um, really useful for splitting wood, um, sort of riving off uh, boards and things like that. And I'm not sure if you'll be able to see this close up on the camera, um, but the handle it came with is starting to develop a little bit of a crack. Um, now, I don't think this is going to cause too much of a problem, um, but just in case, I thought I would uh, just make up a quick spare replacement handle um, in case it ever does go, um, and also because I'm using it out of a piece of green wood, um, just to make sure that it's a fairly simple process. If I'm out and about and the handle does break on me, I can hopefully easily make a new one. Um, so what I'll do, let me move the camera in a little bit and I'll, uh, I'll show you what it is I'm gonna do. Right then guys, so I've selected a piece of timber. Um, again, as usual, piece of birch that I had lying around. Um, and this is approximately, slightly shorter, but not by much, uh, sort of the same length as the handle that I'm trying to make. Um, now all I need to do at this point is decide which end uh, I want to be the bottom end of the handle which has got a slight flare which holds it uh, in place on the fro um, and I'm going to go with this end here. Um, so really all I want to do is take the axe and just start paring this down. Um, I'm going to leave this section where the bark stops um, as my end piece because I can, cut, I can trim this down later and all I want to do really is just pare this down. Um, so I'll crack on with that and uh, we'll come back once it's uh, a little bit closer to size. Okay guys, so we've got a little bit closer now to where we want to be. Um, hopefully you can see that reasonably well on the camera here. So we've taken off a fair bit of material. Um, there's still a, a fair way to go. Um, and what I'm going to do now is move over to my um, draw knife, or push knife in this case, um, and just carry on paring it down with a little bit more care um, so we can start rounding this off so we've got a nice comfortable grip. Right then guys, so I've finished paring this down um, and this now is uh, fairly close to what we're looking for. Uh, it fits onto my fro quite nicely and as you can see, hopefully from there, I've made this a little bit shorter um, because this is actually a softer wood um, so therefore it's not quite as strong um, and obviously the longer I have this, uh, the more leverage there is for essentially to, to break this. Um, so what I'm going to do, I'm just going to tidy this up ever so slightly with the knife uh, just to give it a nice base on the bottom. And what I'm looking to do is basically just take off any high spots um, 
that could get chewed up by the fro while it's on there. Actually that's not too bad there. Uh, the other thing I want to do is just chamfer off the top. And what that will do, there we go. so chamfering off the top like this, uh, which hopefully you can see on the camera there, um, will just help to prevent this from splitting because um, it is still a little bit green. Um, and also, if this gets caught in the fro, um, it gets bound up at the bottom here, what I can do um, is just tap this on the top and obviously by chamfering it off, same as you would with a temp peg or something like that, um, it just helps give that a little bit of strength. Um, so the last thing to do with this, and I've already pre-marked this, is just to take this off with the saw. Nice new handle. It's not the greatest of fits as you can kind of see here, um, but it will be absolutely adequate for what I need it for. Um, you know, I've got something to hold on to while I'm using the fro. And what I'll do, just as a quick demonstration, take a little board off here. So what I've done here is not left enough out of the one side. To get a good purchase. So see if we can get this out. So again, it wasn't a perfect split, um, it's quite a warped piece of wood to be fair, um, but it does show that the fro works, which is good. Um, for something that's taken essentially, oh, I don't know, 20 minutes, I've got a nice little replacement handle. Um, if this one does eventually go on me, which I'm sure it will at some point through uh, heavy and repeated use, doesn't take long to put something together that'll do just as good a job. Hope that was useful guys. Um, comments and questions uh, below in the comments box. Um, subscribe if you want to see more and I hope to see you next time. Cheers guys, thanks a lot.